Hello, BookTube. I'm Todd the Librarian. <laughs> oh, man. <clears throat> Something's not right about this. Okay. This is the last ten books tag, and this is an original tag by Mark Nash. Thank you, Mark, for the tag. And everyone that's not familiar with Mark Nash, Please give his channel a look. And there are ten questions on this tag. First of all, let me... Uh, <clears throat> do this. And of course, you know, if you hear... music over there, somebody getting killed, shot with lasers or whatever, Fallout 4 is going on over that way. Number one. The last book you didn't finish. I just laid that thing out here. Okay, here we go. And that would be Dark Detectives, which was on my September TBR or one of them. And uh, I don't know. It's just it's it's about supernatural mysteries and you know Clive Barker, Neil Gaiman, Brian Lumley, Kim Newman, Peter Tremaine. I just got bogged down and. Uh, See, that's as far as I made it through that book. Number two, the last book you reread <clears throat> Tarzan. Number three, the last book you bought Do Androids Dream of Electric Sheep? by Philip K. Dick, and uh, there, Curtis, Curtis Books and Films, <laughs> I kept telling him I was going to read some Philip K., and he's like, yeah, yeah, sure, because I've, I've been uh, talking that uh, probably since I met him on BookTube, but uh, I'm going to read it now, Curtis. <clears throat> um, hang on, let me put this down here, so I get confused easily. Number four. The last book you said you read, but didn't. I'm not sure if this is classified as a book, but it's Agamemnon by Aeschylus, who was a... He's been uh, categorized as a Greek tragedist, tragedist and as a dramatist as well. And uh, I had to read this for Honors English when I was in college, and... I just had a hard time with it, so <clears throat> when we had our banquet and everybody had to spill their beans on what they had read and so forth, um, I BS'd my way through it because I'm pretty good at talking, so. Um, so, Professor Reed, if you're watching, sorry, man. <laughs> He probably saw right through me. He was a very intelligent man. Okay, number five. Uh, the last book you wrote in the margins of. I didn't, well, I didn't write in the margins, but it's Night Comes of the Cumberlands by Harry M. Cottle. And this was one of my research books for my uh, a novel, Gray Sun and the Colored Rain, which I have not published. And it's about life in a segregated coal camp, circa 1912. But you can see where I have... I'll show you. I highlighted some stuff in here if I can find it. <clears throat> Highlighting. Not notes, but it's pretty close. Oh yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, I came across the surnames of the people from... Uh, England, Scotland, and Ireland that settled in this part of the world. And uh, my wife's uh, last name's in there. Hell, which I think they were from. Was it Scotland, honey? Yeah. Yeah, Scotland. Okay. The last book you had signed. Tarzan of the Apes. It was signed by our very own paperback junkie, Matt Wall. 
who also has some stuff out there that I need to read. Yeah, it wasn't signed by the author. Well, he is an author, so it qualifies. <clears throat> um, the last book you lost. Uh, my couple of my books from the Dark Tower series because I loaned them to my brother's girlfriend and she didn't freaking bring them back. And... You know, you can loan them stuff and they're like, uh, um, well, don't know what happened to it. So, yeah, I'm a little bit pissed about that. <clears throat> but they probably still have the books. They just don't want to look for them. But they moved two or three times. So, <clears throat> the last book you had to replace Return to Eden by Harry Harrison. Yeah. Um, I needed this to complete my trilogy of the East of Eden series. Or, I'm sorry, West of Eden. Dang it. <clears throat> Number nine, the last book you had an argument over. One of my V.C. Andrews books because I loaned it to my cousin and she came back to borrow some books and I was like, uh, yeah, I'll loan you some books. Where's the books I loaned you? Oh, I thought you gave them to me. No, I did not freaking give them to you. I would like those back. It wasn't much of an argument, but... Number 10. The last book you couldn't get hold of. Well, I started a novel. It was fantasy. Uh, had 120 some pages. It was called The Elite. And by... I mean, now, I've seen this in other novels where darkness is creeping over the land and they have to figure out what's causing it, but... I had a whole new take on that, and I started writing this during my creative writing uh, class in college, and uh, my ex-wife burned the thing. I can't find it, so. That's the one I can't get a hold of, and I'll, I don't know if I'll ever try to recreate that. But, uh. So that is the last ten books tag. Like I said, this was an original tag by Mark Nash. Thanks again, Mark, for tagging me. And everyone else... As usual, thanks for joining me and uh, watching me hang out in the penthouse. And uh, bye.